All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to configure IP addresses using the desktop tab. Now, the desktop tab is only available on the PC, the laptop, and the server. There's no desktop tab if you click on the printer. So if you click on the printer, the only way of configuring an IP address is using the config tab, which we saw in a previous video. All right, so I'm going to select the laptop. And when we come into the laptop, normally by default it shows the physical view. So along the top we want to click on desktop and then click on the first icon here, the IP configuration. So when I click on that, it brings me up uh, the screen with the IP configuration and it's by default set to static. So all we have to do in here in one single screen is key in the information that we're given. So I'll say that the IP address is 192. 0.168.1.25 and I click on the subnet mask again it will put in the default subnet mask for the class so this is a class C address so it's giving me the default subnet mask for class C addresses okay and finally it'll ask for the default gateway so 192.168.1.1 remember you cannot have the same IP address as the default gateway in the top box. Okay, so I've entered those three pieces of information and then to save it, I just click the X in the corner and I click X again and just hover over the laptop and I can see that the IP address has been set and that the gateway address has been set. I'll just do the same very quickly for the server. So server, desktop, IP configuration, given an address 192.168.1.55 click in the subnet mask box and it fills in the default subnet mask for that class and the gateway and remember the gateway on all the devices will be the same because all devices on the same network go out through the same gateway I'll click X to close it and this time I'll use a command prompt so if I click on command prompt and type the word IP config and press enter it will give me the IP address the subnet mask and the gateway address and I can just close that close that and that's how you set the IP address using the desktop tab on devices